Hello, I'm Mike Russell from MusicRadioCreative.com. In this video, I'll show you how to change the duration of a multi-track in Adobe Audition CC. So here we are in the multi-track. Everything's on to record. It's looking good, but you can see 30 seconds is the maximum I can go to. Like I can zoom in on this. I can zoom anywhere I want along my multi-track, but the maximum I can go to is 30 seconds. That's the hard limit. And I want to do more than 30 seconds of production in my multi-track. Well, this is a default thing in the Adobe Audition multi-track that you may not know about. So if I try and scroll over with my bar, no, I cannot go further than 30 seconds. When you move a clip, say we cut this clip in half, let's just do a cut there, Command or Control K, boom, cut in half. When you start moving clips to the end of your multi-track, boom, look at that. Immediately, it increases and we've got another minute on. So essentially, you've got to move some audio up against the end to increase the length of your multi-track. So the bigger your session file becomes, the bigger your multi-track will become, but no bigger than it needs to be. So I'll move this up to 55 seconds. It's still only a minute. Bit more, only a minute. As soon as I hit the one minute mark, boom, we've now got a minute and a half. So essentially, the more audio you put in, the bigger your multi-track becomes. If you want a multi-track that by default is uh, maybe three minutes long, we just need to move this all the way out. We need to zoom out and move until we get to the three minute mark here, which is here. Now we have a three minute multi-track and now we can work inside that three minutes until we need more time and then we move another clip to the end and it gets longer. But the multi-track will never get longer than it needs to be for your current piece of production work. <laughs> 